So you might be trying to figure out how you can connect your Switch Pro controller to Steam. Now doing this is actually very, very basic and it really does not take too much time at all. The first thing you wanna do is you wanna go and connect your you know, Switch Pro controller to your PC. So you can do this by either going inside of your you know, settings application or whatever. So you wanna go inside of your Bluetooth settings. So go inside of there, it should take only like one second for you to do this. And then what you're going to wanna to do is you wanna go and click on add device and we wanna go and basically get into our Bluetooth section. Now we wanna put our Switch Pro controller into pairing mode and we can do this by basically holding down the sync button that's at the top portion of our Switch Pro controller. So hold on this button at the very top and at some point the green lights at the bottom should start blinking back and forth. And just in case my controller is dead, and I think my controller was dead, but I can hold down that sync button at the very top right there and these green lights at the bottom are going to start blinking back and forth. So just like this, it'll be in pairing mode as you can see. And now we wanna make our way over to our Pro Controller right here. So on my Windows PC, I can see Pro Controller. I'm going to click on connect and it's going to automatically connect to my you know, PC. So whether I have a Mac or Linux or whatever. And once it's connected, all I wanna do now is I wanna go back inside of my Steam settings. Now when I'm here, there should be a little option where it says device support unknown. Sometimes it'll say something like that. But what we wanna do is we wanna click on the top right corner to get into our Steam option. And we wanna click on settings. So now when we're on settings, what we wanna do next is we want to basically go through and we wanna find the little option that says control. So there should be a little controller option here. We wanna click on it. And then we should see that our Switch Pro controller is accessible here. So find the Switch Pro controller. All you wanna do is make sure that it is you know, findable here. And that's pretty much all we're going to have to do. At this point, your controller should be synced up and that's pretty much all you're going to have to do. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, so then.